our museum the new churches it is a statement that is made by jason fargo in a very provocative essay that was posted in the bbc website rather recently and he talks about the importance of museums and how they parallel our growing interest in art and the importance of art in our culture. In Los Angeles, we saw recently the opening of a very large museum, the Broad Museum, which focuses mainly on contemporary art. But in other parts of the world, we, we see the importance and renewal and rediscovery of museums. Abu Dhabi and Helsinki are waiting for uh, to be satellites of Guggenheim. And he traces this um, reinterest or this, 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 this reemergence of museum to 1990 when um, Frank Gehry uh, did the Guggenheim in Bilbao, Spain. And if you remember, it was uh, alluded to to be like a cathedral and, and so forth. And in the past, big name architects were always after commissions for big churches. Now, they're all after commissions for museums and they are uh, getting them. One of the sentence in the article was particularly provocative to me. He says that we make pilgrimage to museums in order to experience transcendence. And he puts pilgrimage and transcendence in quotes. And of course, that is why we go to churches to experience transcendence. And when we look at, at, at art, uh, whether it's in a museum or not, but museum is the repository of art for, for many of us, we have to reach into something uh, that is beyond ourselves in order to connect to that uh, piece of art. And uh, perhaps museums do what churches are meant to do, but they can do it better. Why do I say they could do it better? Because they can build bridges in a way that contemporary churches sometimes do not. They can help us connect, not only within ourselves, but to each other, from community to community, nation to nation. I mean, we think nothing of going to Bilbao or going to uh, any other countries to see some of these famous museums. And so, this bridge building aspect, this way museums have of reaching into our deepest aspect of who we are and to transcend our ordinary self uh, is something that is very, very important, I believe. And perhaps it for the time being, or in the future, I do not know, we will have to wait and see, it does become an adjunct or a supplement or perhaps a substitute for what churches do. Thank you for listening. I'm Danielle Levy.